Hi, I'm Elizabeth Chapman from Pipkin Middle School, and I am coming to you to ask for a grant for um, a, not a flexible learning space because I already have several of those, as you can see. but more for building a space within the flexible learning spaces that I already have that does more than just learn. It's a place for kids to be able to refocus. Um, this would be a place that we use for when a kid is very angry, very upset, having a really bad day, and that happens quite often. I made a space right now that just has the futon that no one's allowed to sit at any other time. At this space, I have had it for about a week and a half, and I've already used it three times. The one problem with this is if you see right now, it is up front. And I say up front, there is really no front or back to my classroom, but um, it is right there. And when someone is trying to refocus and retool and like get themselves collected and back together, other kids can see them, and that is an issue. So I am wanting to get a nice, either like a canopy or a divider where that place could be private, um, but also where I can still see them. So I position, I will position the area that I do my small groups right next to it so I can see them and work with them as well so that they don't feel quite alone, but still, are alone enough that they can get themselves back together. I really fought with the idea of putting kids in this video. I <laughs> have heard that you have so much more of a chance of getting what you need for your kids if they're in the video, but the whole purpose of this area is for privacy. And so that would kind of be an oxymoron compared to what I'm trying to accomplish. So. I hate being on camera, but my kids are definitely worth it. They are worth me going out on this limb and me sitting in front of a camera. So I hope that you consider us for this grant so that we can get the canopy as well as some retooling and refocusing um, tools like stress balls and adult coloring books and things like that for my kids. I want them to be able to have a place where they can refocus and retool, and that would be a place that anyone in this grade level could use. They could send them to my room if they need to do that. The biggest part of that is that they should be able to reintegrate, and that has been able to happen with what I have here working, but it could be better, and that's what I'm going for. Thank you for your time. Elizabeth Troutman, Pipkin Middle School.